Hi all, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are going to look into another multi pack stock. So, um, this stock has given us a return of 25% for the you know three years. So, um, this is a stock which um, you know is used by many of us every in our day to day life. So, we'll uh, see which stock, which company it is, and the detailed review of that company. So, Let's get in and see which stock it is. Okay, H U L, so it is Hindustan Unilever Limited. So many of us know what Hindustan Unilever does or manufactures. So it was founded in the year 1933 so it's a very old company almost 85 years old company uh, its headquarters is in mumbai and uh, this comes under the fmcg sector um, in the personal care and uh, what does um, they manufacture they manufacture foods cleansing agents personal care products and water purifiers so you all know what all they you know manufacture like Lakme, Lifebuoy, Little, all these are manufactured by Hindustan Unilever. So let's look into the net profit of this company. So in March it was um, more, but for June it was gone down by uh, four crores. For so for March it was thousand five hundred twenty nine crores, whereas for June it is thousand five hundred twenty five crores. Looking at the sales also has reduced for the June quarter. For March it was 9,356 crores whereas for June it is um, 9,138 crores. Let's look at uh, the share details of the stock. I mean the NSC code is H-I-N-D-U-N-I-L-V-R and the BSC code is 500696. The PE is 61 whereas the industry PE is 63. The 52 week low is 1226 rupees whereas the high is 1808 rupees. The face value is 1. The TTM EPS is 26 and the price book value is 47. Let's look into the shareholdings of this um, you know, stock. So there is no Indian promoter because this is a MNC, this is a foreign company. So the foreign promoters are 67 percentage, the DII are 7.31 uh, percentage, the FII that's foreign institutional investors are 12 percent and others are 13 percentage. So we'll see the mutual fund investment in the stock. So totally a number of 223 schemes have invested in this particular stock with an amount of 5,931 crores in which SBI ETF Nifty 50 fund has invested the maximum amount which is 1,051 crores but Reliance ETF fund holds the maximum weightage which is 18.13 percentage. Now we will see the top 5 uh, mutual fund schemes which is holding the stock. So first one is SBI ETF Nifty 50 which hold, which has invested the 1051 crores. Next is SBI ETF Sensex which has invested 405 crores. The next one is ICICI Prudential Balanced Advantage Fund which has invested 351 crores. The fourth one is Aditya Birla Sun Life Frontline Equity Growth Fund which has invested 310 crores and the fifth one and the last one is SBI Magnum Global Fund which is invested 277 crores. So let's look into the returns given by the stock over the period of uh, 10 years. So for one year it is given as a return of 29 percentage for three years 25 percentage five years 21 percentage and for 10 years 22 percentage so you all can see it is a, it is given us a very decent return and uh, you know if at all you want to invest in the stock please do your own research and then start investing as i always say start thinking and happy investing 
Thank you for watching the video and do not forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so that you get notified as we upload a new video. All the information provided in this channel is only for general guidance and educational purpose. Don't consider this as a recommendation from our side. Please do your own research or seek a financial advisor prior to investing. You can follow us even on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you.